I just had a question from Wonders of the Heart who was wondering, how do I use Zoom and like a worksheet tool like commoncoresheets.com? Uh, now, there is a really easy way to do this, and all you have to do, and lots of people think that they have to like upload the document, because this is how like other systems used to work. You used to have to upload it pre, before working with a student uh, into the system. And now you no longer have to worry about doing any of that. You can just share your screen. So there's gonna be a green button. You're gonna click share screen. Uh, from there, you're gonna have some choices. I always choose desktop just because if you ever change what you're working on, the student will see then what you see. If you make one of the other choices, then they can only see that choice. So I always choose desktop. And then you can go to commoncoresheets.com. That's commoncoresheets.com. If you forget what it is, you can just throw that into Google and it will find it for you. It will be the first thing that will come on up. And then you are going to be able to create different worksheets. And you can use these worksheets by having the child actually annotating on the screen. So there is a button. What's going to happen, there's going to be a tool at the very top of your Zoom when you're sharing the screen that will say annotate. And the same thing will happen for the child as well on the other side. So all you have to do is guide them into clicking on annotate. They're going to click on draw. And now they can draw a line from one thing to another. So they need to find uh, one circle plus two circles. And so they can actually draw a line like that. And they can draw on your screen, which is pretty cool. And then you can later on, if you wanted to put the answers on in here, you could say that three went with A. And you've got that on in there. Um, so this it's a really great way to be able to have the child be active in the online world with any tools that you are using for them. So annotate works fantastic. Now if you had a document where uh, you had a tool or something where you wanted the child to actually like be entering in numbers and stuff, let's say you were using IXL.com, you can actually give the child access to your controller and then they can just be entering it on in. So you're both looking at the same screen, you're both looking at the same thing, and they have access to being able to just be a little bit more active versus just telling me what the answers are and you writing them on in. They can actually do it. So great question. Thanks for asking. And I can't wait to hear some of the other questions that you guys have.